Mega projects are massive, complicated ventures that usually cost millions and billions of dollars, take several years to develop and build, including numerous public and private stakeholders, are transformative, and impact millions of people. In this video, we'll continue our list of biggest mega projects under construction in 2023, starting with number 9, Frankfurt 4. At the heart of Frankfurt, on a site that has been inaccessible for 45 years, four new high-rise towers will change the city's skyline from above. The construction of these 228-meter tall buildings will pave the way for developing new streets and a dynamic urban neighborhood with a balanced mix of commercial, residential, and leisure purposes. The Frankfurt 4 project brings together facilities that will create a vibrant new neighborhood for Frankfurt, its tourists, and its future residents using a development model exclusive to Europe. The Frankfurt 4 is expected to finish by the end of 2023. Next we have Iconic Tower. Egypt is seeing a lot of significant changes in the real estate sector thanks to the new administrative capital and massive projects that are under construction. One of these projects is the Iconic Tower, which is regarded as a distinctive Egyptian landmark and a popular tourist destination in modern Egypt history. The 400-meter tower is anticipated and intended to surpass the 222.5-meter tall Carlton Center skyscraper in central Johannesburg as the highest structure in Africa. After Dubai's Burj Khalifa, it will be the second tallest tower in the Middle East. The construction of this massive structure was completed in less than five years and is scheduled to have the finishing touches in 2023 before opening to public. At number 7, Rail Baltica. It is a trans-European rail project that aims to link the Baltic states to the current European rail network. The project will modernize and enhance the route in Western Europe, connecting Poland, Finland, and the Baltic states of Estonia, Latvia, and Lithuania. It will unify transport in Europe by linking the Baltic region's 1,520mm broad gauge track with a 1,435mm standard gauge track used by European countries. It is anticipated that by 2024, the section of the railway line in the Baltic nations will finish its constructions. And by 2025, the route linking Tallinn, Riga, and Kaunas is expected to be operational, while the Warsaw connection will be done by 2030. More so, $6.19 billion in funding and investments are needed to make the Rail Baltica project possible. Next on our list is the Fimarn Belt Tunnel. The Fimarn Belt Tunnel is planned 18 km immersed tunnel between Rodbeheim, Denmark, and Puttgart in Germany. Once completed, the fixed line will set a new record for the longest road or rail tunnel in the world by becoming the longest immersed tunnel. The project includes building a four-lane highway and a train line with two electrified tracks. The Fimarn Belt Tunnel will take around 8.5 years to be completed and requires roughly $7.9 billion of funding. Next we have Brenner Base Tunnel. It is a 55 km long rail tunnel constructed under the Brenner Pass, an important north-south connection over the Alps in Europe. It will be the longest railway tunnel in the world when it opens in 2026 and will be the current southern diversion around Innsbruck. The Brenner Base Tunnel will be 64 km long. The tunnel will connect Italy and Austria, starting in Fortessa, Italy and ending in Innsbruck, Austria. At number 4, Flammable 3. Electricité de France, or EDF, is adding a new 1,570 MW European Pressurized Water Reactor, or EPR, to its Flammable nuclear power plant in Normandy, France. The new reactor, known as Flammable 3, is the first third-generation plant to be developed. The $12.38 billion project is expected to produce 13 terawatt hour of energy annually and have a thermal output of 4,300 thermal megawatts. In April of 2007, the French government approved the Flammable 3 project's construction license, and in December of the same year, work on the project officially started. Unfortunately, decades have passed and billions of dollars have been spent more than planned due to unprecedented events. The French government its taxpayers, and EDF anticipates that the project will start generating electricity at the end of 2023, assuming nothing else goes wrong. Next on our list is the Hinkley Point C. Hinkley Point C in Somerset is the first new nuclear power plant developed in the United Kingdom in over 20 years. It will provide enough low-carbon energy to power almost 6 million households and provide thousands of employment and long-term economic benefits. The construction and operation of Hinkley Point C will create 25,000 employment opportunities and up to 1,000 apprenticeships. And 64% of project's construction value is predicted to go to UK companies. 
the new nuclear power plant won't begin producing electricity until 2027. And during the last seven years, cost projections have increased from $20 billion to $30 billion. Next we have ITER. The goal of the International Thermonuclear Experimental Reactor, or ITER project for short, is to show that fusion energy is technically and scientifically possible. It is situated near Cadahache, France, just north of Auxen-Provence. The main building will hold the biggest tokamak reactor in the world, a cylinder measuring 28 meters in diameter and 29 meters in height and weighing no less than 23,000 tons. The complex will feature a reinforced concrete building that is 120 meters long, 80 meters wide, and 80 meters high, together with two adjacent auxiliary structures. Other structures include an assembly and various industrial buildings. The project also calls for large nuclear doors that withstand radiation at high pressure. This $22 billion project will be the largest fusion energy experiment ever conducted in the world. It was the first fusion device to generate more heat than was required to initiate the fusion reaction. ITER was intended to test its first plasma in 2020 and accomplish full fusion by 2023. However, the schedule has been changed and they will now test the first plasma in 2025 and achieve full fusion in 2035. And finally, at number 1, we have the new Silk Road. One of the largest infrastructure projects ever conceived in China's Belt and Road Initiative, or BRI, often known as the New Silk Road. President Xi Jinping launched a massive collection of development and investment programs in 2013. The New Silk Road was initially conceived to provide a physical infrastructure to connect East Asia and Europe. China's economic and political power has dramatically increased during the last 10 years due to the project's expansion into Africa, Oceania, and South America. The New Silk Road has a vast network of railways, energy pipelines, highways, and streamlined border crossings, both westward through the mountainous former Soviet republics and southward to Pakistan, India, and the rest of Southeast Asia. The project is expected to be finished in 2049, which also happens to be the 100th anniversary of the PRS's founding. And with that, ends our series of the world's most impressive mega projects under construction in 2023. If you haven't watched the part 1 of this series, make sure to click the link below. What do you think about the future of these mega projects under construction? Will all of them be completed? Or will some be too realistic to achieve? Let us know your opinion in the comment section. We hope you enjoyed this video. If you haven't already, click the like and subscribe button. We'll be back soon with another video about luxury. So remember to activate that notification bell.